Hello everyone and welcome again to my YouTube channel. Right, so welcome to this EasyBot video where I'm just going to show you some results. I think you guys will find, find this very interesting. Um, so basically they backtested EasyBot. So this was last year before they even launched it um, to the public. Um, you know, as you guys know, EasyBot was officially launched the 31st of March and obviously I was there. I've been with EasyBot since the beginnings. I mean, I heard about it um, early March and then you know, I couldn't wait wait for it to launch because I saw this is gonna this is gonna be something that is a breath of fresh air, you know, in a in an industry where there's so many you know, so many scams out there that promise you ridiculous ridiculous returns, but there's no trading going on, there's no transparency, all of that. So yeah, guys, let's get into it. Um so this was as you could see through to Backtesting was started with the, these bots around February, January, February. They started. So let's first go on the, on the um, notes here, notes notes on backtesting. This data, data represents the initial incomplete backtesting results for EasyBot's technical capabilities and one-click strategy. Important thing to note, one-minute candle limitations. EasyBot is programmed to read and, and respond to the market every second. This high-speed performance leads to more opportunities to open and close trades in profit. However, for the results presented here, we, we could only access one-minute historical candles. What this means is that for each minute, we are backtesting. There are 59 opportunities that were unaccounted for. Jeepers. So we believe that EasyBot's real-world performance will therefore produce even more profitable trades as a result. So this was backtesting results, guys. So... Um, if they actually had this on a real, if they had this on a real account with real money, right, they would have probably made more. That's what they're saying. Or even on a, just on a demo account to see, because again, like they just mentioned here, there's 50, 59 opportunities that were unaccounted for, you know, with the back testing. So another thing, no auto compounding. The results here do not consider EasyBot's automatic compounding feature. With auto compounding enabled, EasyBot is sure to have returned higher higher profits over the same test period so the auto compounding feature as you guys know is part of the easy bot right um it's it compounds of every single trade so every single trade that takes profit right your the your basically your um account balance increases right with every single trade little by little so as soon as you've made profit of the trade the bot will auto compound that so it's auto compounding on a trade per trade base basis. So which is massive potential just you know if you guys know anything about compounding interest you'll know it's huge. So another thing I just want to go back to the back testing again back testing is what you do when when you trade, right? Is you go back in history and you see how the markets move and then you work out a strategy and then you do your back testing and see okay how how well did that strategy perform right so the back testing basically tells you how um, you would have done with a certain strategy if you actually traded with that strategy so whether it's again successful whether it would have been a successful strategy or not so it's a, obviously back testing is again it's very very accurate way of seeing how your strategy would have done and and will do because obviously how do you how do you know how your bot or how your trading strategy is going to perform in the future um, you simply um, back test it and then you get a pretty good idea right all right so now we're here on BTC and ETH performance so of the three coins presented here Bitcoin do I even need to scroll down on this I don't even need to but okay sorry about that of the three coins presented here Bitcoin um, and Ethereum do not generally perform as well as other altcoin cryptocurrencies due to their comparatively low volatility easy bot performs best when there is a lot of volatility movement up or down so the more movement up and down the, um, there is the better for the easy bot because then it has more opportunities to make profit right so what is back testing oh, i already said that back what is back testing back testing assesses the viability of a trading strategy by discovering how it would play out using historical data back testing simulates a trading strategy using historical data, I don't know, data, data, 
to generate results and analyze risk and profitability before risking any ac actual capital. So yeah, guys, whether you're trading yourself or whether you're trading with a bot, you have to do back testing first to make sure your strategy or your bot works properly. A well-conducted con backtest that yields positive results assures traders that the strategy is fundamentally sound and is likely to yield profits when implemented in reality. And if you guys want to know how the bot actually did in more recent results on, on actually on a real account, but, uh, what is going on here? Oh, uh, gee whiz. Seriously? Okay, uh, let me just go in here. There we go. If you want to know how it did uh, more recently, then um, just close that. I mean, why does it? Anyways, if you want to know how the bot did recently, you can simply just uh, have a look at this. Um, this And again, guys, keep in mind, this is in a bear market still, guys, in a downtrending market, and we're still making these results. So you can expect something crazy, the three to four, like two, three to four times these returns in a, in a bull market. And again, it's not, I'm not promising anything. I'm just saying, you know, based on the data, um, being, being this good in a downtrending market in an uptrending market obviously we can expect better results right but the big thing is you want to know if the bot will make profits for you in all market conditions so it, because everyone's an expert when the market goes up but when it goes down you know that's when you really see um, if a strategy really works or not you know especially with spot trading where there's no leverage I mean you can only do buys in spot trading you can't do sells because again you're buying into actual crypto um, so let's have a look at the best performing one or let's go with the worst to the best okay so the best the worst performing one was bitcoin because it's the least volatile coin jeez but even bitcoin bitcoin is already a very volatile coin but uh yeah let's let's go to sheet uh, let's go have a look at bitcoin i mean here you can see all the trades that bitcoin put in so it's all these little trades guys that add up pretty insane is it just put the slider on let's see uh, we can see the profit here so as you can see all these little trades that the bot did 60 cent profit there 60 cent profit there and it kept there's almost there's like a nine cent profit there's a six uh, 0.66 profit here's a three cent profit But it performs all, so many of these little trades, right, that add up to a pretty big percentage, and especially if you compound this. And again, guys, these results, these percentages are you seeing are without compounding, uh, and again, basically missing 59 opportunities. So again, since the bot is live now, we're seeing much better returns on this, on it, so then the backtesting results, right, so all basically this is all the trades that would have put in um ultimately what 1213 trades um profit 108 dollars and 63 cents uh average monthly profit is 14 dollars monthly is 2.36 percent so you might not think that's a lot but again guys it's still it's still way better than what the bank will give you you'll probably end up making more money with this than with any of the scam platforms because of because usually what, well, if you have my luck uh, um, in the past, you know, I didn't know any better. So I would try other platforms thinking they are legit, right? And then I, I put my money on and always, in, and, and always when I wanted to withdraw, I couldn't. So, <laughs> you know, first rule of, ma of making money is don't lose your money. That's what Warren Buffett said. And second rule is don't forget the first rule. But this is the worst performing one. And again, no auto compounding um, and basically missing a lot of opportunities, right? So yeah, that's that's pretty good still. We're still making money. And yeah, so that's pretty cool. So I just want to have a look at the chart for that time period. And we can just have an idea of how the market moves. So it was from, uh, let's have a look here. Okay, it was from, uh, I think, what, February? 
yeah, basically January um, all the way down to uh, gee, August. Yeah, Bitcoin did really well in that time frame. But you can see we also had those market crashes, um, some nasty ones. So yeah, let's go from February 2021. It did pretty good. Okay, let's start from January. My Bitcoin was sitting at about 39,000. Then we went all the way up to 65,000 almost. An all time high, obviously reaching almost, uh, it's almost, almost 70,000 in uh, November, right? But you, the thing is, right, is the market always does pullbacks, always, it's always going to come back down before it goes back up again. Um, so the easy bot basically made profits even when the market crashed down there, came back up again. So that's the big thing, guys, is profits in all market conditions. When other bots were basically, I mean, when the market was crashing like this, then other bots were basically, <laughs> all the gains you made were basically non-existent anymore. So, all right, so now we're going to have a look at a coin called Ethereum. So a lot of you also know, know Ethereum well. Um, so let's look at the results with obviously with no compounding and with uh, basically missing a lot of opportunities as well of the back testing but it's just a rough basically it's just to give you a rough idea um, what the bot has been doing what what it's capable of so yeah all the, all of these trades and if we look back in profits let's look at the profit loss you see sometimes 17 cents there 52 cents here 64 cents there I mean it's oh, that was a, was a good one 73 cents Little profits, guys, but that add up and make a lot of profits, right? That added up to those percent, pretty good percentage, almost 5% average per month. And again, with no compounding. So, yeah, there we have the $600 of capital. We made $27.39. Monthly average profit is 4.57%. And if we have a look at the chart on Ethereum for that time frame, Let's have a look at let's have a look at it. Oh my word, this thing. Okay, let's let's have a look. Okay, so Ethereum was hovering when the bot started was hovering around one four one five uh, dollars. So. Then it had a big pump, just like, it looks very similar to Bitcoin, really. Um, and then it had a big dump, right? Big pullback right there. Then the market swung back up again. So, a nice big, nice big push. So the bot probably started, stopped trading around here. Well, the back testing, I mean. Um, so, yeah, in that time frame, we made the profits that you just saw. So let's have a look at another bot called Aave, another coin called Aave, right? A-A-V-E. So the best performing one, 8.89% per month average. And let's look, let's look at how it did, right? This is a very volatile coin, if you ask me. It's just, geez, it's crazy. Look at where it was and in all, <laughs> it's a massive crash. But I think we're going to see a major pump. Again, the crypto markets are really, really good. It's a really good time to buy, if you ask me, you know. But, I mean, if you have, the easy bot will, will do it for you. <laughs> That's why it's there. <laughs> it's literally our slogan is crypto made easy. Because why would you might want to make it hard for yourself, right? You have to sit and watch charts the whole day. All right, so... A A V A E are they? Bot started trading this around January, February, right? At a massive pump. This was crazy. Look at this. Massive pump, right? <laughs> then, then it did quite a quite a decent sized pullback here, right? Goes up, it has to come back down again. At least a fifty percent crash drop, whatever you want to call it. 
Then it went back up again. She's quite a, a lot of movement in this coin, eh? And it reached this all-time high of what around six hundred and seventy dollars a coin, all the way down to one seventy. So that was a very very big drop. Jeepers! Then it went back up again, quite significantly as well. Re I mean that's basically from one seventy-five to four forty-seven. That's quite a pump. It's like one and a half times. So yeah, then it went back up again, back down again. And we stopped at about, what, August, July, around there, right? So it caught all of this movement, and in that time, averaged 9% a month with the crashes, with the ups, with the downs, and that's what you want to see, right? You want to make profits all the time. See, even when the market's going down, what the bot will do is it will basically bring down the average. And it will wait before it actually places a trade. It won't just mindlessly put the trades in. But even when it does, it will just it will continue to trade in between. It never stops trading. So we'll make these little profits even when the market's going down. And obviously, you need to be patient in with it. And it will keep bringing down the average. Eventually, it will get to a point where the market swings back up again. It will get to that average price. It will, it will cycle off the whole position, take profit. And, um, yeah. Also, take your unrealized profit. So... Pretty good, a full foolproof strategy, guys. Um, designed to make profits in all market conditions, even with a freaking volatile coin like Aave. So yeah, interesting stuff. I actually want to look at uh, if we can manage to see one of the big profits here, because like yeah, okay, here, here was a pretty decent one, one point one dollar and thirty three cents. So that was probably where it cycled, where it uh, sold off one massive position. Here's also a big one. Uh, to almost two dollars there. Wonder what it would have done with auto compounding because again it's a trade per trade um, basis where it auto compounds. I think it would it would be pretty insane. Oh, this was a good one, three dollars. Again, it it sold off all of those positions. So sell all, as you can see, it triggered cover one, cover two, cover three, cover four, and it sold off all of those positions and it made a, uh, more than a three dollar profit. This was also a big one, yeah. Four dollars and seventy cents. And it's pretty much the same as that other one we talked about. Cover one, cover two, cover three, sold off all the positions, made a good profit. And the good thing about this bot, guys, is it won't just sell when the market's one percent or one point five percent in profit. It will it will follow if the market keeps going up, it will follow the market. And when it only when it does a decent sized pullback will it take profit so again a very very good strategy built into the spot to basically make sure that you maximize your profits also but also in a safe way right you don't want you don't just want to get in too aggressively and then at the wrong time the market crashes and you spread yourself too thin good profit there i'm just trying to look at a few good ones uh Oh well, I mean as you can see, just small little profits and scrolling, 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 scrolling. Jeez, a lot of trades, eh guys? I mean you're looking at ridiculous amount of trades. Okay, well basically twenty fourth <laughs> oh my word, okay. Twenty-four thousand two hundred and thirteen trades. Right? <laughs> oh well. Actually, gee, I actually misread this, but basically, um, including the buys, buys and sells, but the sells are basically just, again, selling off the crypto and putting it into USDT, so still a lot of trades done, done guys, I mean, probably half of, half of this amount I just saw there, but it's, I mean, I guess, I guess you guys just get the idea, <laughs> a lot of trades, a lot of small profits that add up, um, so yeah, capital six hundred as you saw, monthly profit average of fifty three dollars for that time period. Monthly profit eight point eight nine percent. Pretty cool. 
Uh, there's something I noticed here that caught my eye. Hmm, okay. Never mind. All right, so that's that's that, guys. I think we covered. Yeah, we covered all the coins. Just some in-depth analysis. I know for some of you this is probably really boring, but uh, I know for you numbers guys, this is this is a treat. You want to see this stuff? So yeah, let's let's do something cool. Let's use the same amount, right? 600 uh, and compound it. I guess we we can only compound it monthly, but let's see if it even made a little bit more profits compounded monthly. So because again, like I said, the easy bot compounds a trade for straight trade basis, so which is more obviously more potential. But <laughs> yeah, let's just go monthly. Let's go with Bitcoin first. Let's just type in a 2.38 percent or whatever it was. Right. Um, Seven seven months, seven months. It's, uh, let's just do one year. It's fine. Uh, okay. So calculate, and we're not adding any funds, guys. So we're just taking this. Oh no, wait. Let's just go seven months because this is seven months. Calculate. Hmm, okay. Made well, slightly more. Yeah, made slightly more than this amount. So, uh, anyways, let's go with uh, Ethereum was four point five seven, and then we have seven months there. Calculate. Okay, two hundred and twenty. How much did we? If we look back at the sheet. Huh. Okay. Okay, Bitcoin was spot on there. Yeah, I thought it made more. Okay, hundred. Uh, 2.36%, not 2.38, but uh, it's almost the same thing, really. 191, but we got, just with compounding monthly, it's really a bit of a difference here, but but Ethereum was uh, seven months. Yeah, it was seven months. Aave was 6.5 months. Bitcoin was, was it seven months? I think it was seven months. Okay, so let's go with Aave and let's have a look. Okay, trade for trade basis, this would probably be 300, I, would, I reckon, or more, I don't know, not 100% sure. Right, uh, let's go with, Arbe was 8.89%, 8 uh, 6.5, I wonder if we can type in 6.5, 6. Ah, there we go, yeah, 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 that's perfect. Alright, so... 6.5 months, compounding at 8.89%. Total interest earned. Okay, it started with 600, 400. So how much? How much does it say here? I mean, already 54 dollars more. And on 600 dollars again, guys, it if we're only using 600 dollars of capital here. So your portfolio keeps increasing without having to worry. Oh, you know, is it is the platform going to rug pull tomorrow? Um, you know, where's the money coming from? Things like that, right? I mean, if EasyBot is simply a bot you connect to your Binance or KuCoin exchange and then it trades for you and and it increases your portfolio. That's that. If EasyBot disappears tomorrow, your your all of your money that, that you have, right, in your Binance or KuCoin exchange would still be there, including all the profits the bot made for you because <laughs> that's where it's trading. Um, it's not trading in the platform itself. It's trading in Binance or KuCoin. Because you connected with an API key, right? So, yeah, I think I think that's enough of that, guys. Um, just uh, shared quite a bit there. Trading Uniswap, so we'll see how it goes. I started this bot up a day and a half ago. Made a pretty good profit with Bitcoin. I think 24, 25 days was like 7.2%. Right, so we'll see how Uniswap goes. And Bitcoin is actually one of the worst performing coins, guys, just if you don't know. Like uh, if you go if you go back on that sheet up, okay, uh, for some reason it still was does want to pop up, but all right, it's a little glitch there. Um, so yeah, I mean if you guys don't know, you can just do your bot settings here. You can see how what it's doing. You know, 
obviously on easy bought boarding those two covers waiting for it to take profit and all your trades are happening in Binance. Let's just refresh this page because you'll see how your, your crypto our crypto fluctuates, right? <laughs> so what the, all that the bot does is it, um, it takes your USDT and it buys in the coin you're trading with. So in, in my case, Uniswap. So as you can see, the Uni covers it bought in. Buys in the actual coin itself, which makes it even lower risk because as soon as you trade with leverage, oof, it can get nasty very quickly. It's... Leverage can make you a lot of money really quickly, but it can, you can also blow all of your money really quickly as well, even quicker, <laughs> right? So, uh, yeah, as you can see, here are the covers, the Uniswap trades that it put in. The Bitcoin trade was one I sold off um, myself because I basically created a new bot um, and the bot still had a position of Bitcoin in. I could have set the bot to... Um, single instead of cycle and the bot would have just sold it off anyways right and then stop trading and then I would have just could have just switched over to uh, Uniswap anyways but ah well it looks like something's happening look at this something's happening with Bitcoin oh, interesting so yeah this is where the magic happened guys in your Binance or KuCoin exchange KuCoin looks pretty much almost the same right so both are cryptocurrency exchanges, which are very, very secure. I mean, from, in my opinion, crypto, crypto exchanges are about this, just as secure in, as your bank is. I mean, I don't keep much money in the bank. Um, I try and keep as much money in my crypto exchange, though, to keep making money on it, right? Because, I mean, you're not making, you're actually losing money by keeping your your money in the bank. So why not just keep it in your exchange? Have something like the EasyBot gradually increase your portfolio, right? Not financial advice, guys, just saying from, you know, from my point of view. Uh, yeah okay so obviously guys if you want to know more about the easy bot um, I post like daily almost daily updates on it you know how I'm doing result wise um, things like that you know plenty of content content on so have a look at that you can also join my telegram group the link for that is below my easy bot success group um, where I basically share the team resources as well. This is actually one of the team resources that we have, this this whole uh, Excel spreadsheet. Uh, so yeah, you can, I mean, you basically get that for free um, as, as part of my team. So yeah, guys, you wanna sign up right away, my link's also below. You wanna reach out to me personally, my phone number is also below. So feel free to send me a message on WhatsApp anyway. Comment below as well if you have any questions or queries. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my co content. Um, and have a good one. Cheers.